And also one other thing to add about the actuator. It's not a big problem to get the normal uh, pressure uh, actuator here inside because you can use the original plate and because you just need such an angle here so the possibility is here to just add here because the GT15 actuator I see two bolts coming out so on one side you just need to add some washers or a or nut to get a pivot point and then you can change the angle of the actuator and it should work to to get the, the arm longer it's not a big problem just to thread uh, the arm and add something to get this longer that's not not, not the biggest problem other possibility is just to uh, add weld here a bigger plate and so with the, with the nut or the washer we can also adjust the, the pivot point or also raise the actuator a little bit higher because we have here enough still enough uh, room for play so all in all not a big problem should be very easy to to get this done to be honest without using the vacuum actuator and using the old GT15 actuator from the old turbo so yeah should fine should work fine to be honest sadly it's not my turbo <laughs> I have to give this back it's from the friend of mine it's going to be on his uh, tw uh, 220 SDI so we'll see how much power this will create so then this will be the last video, see ya